guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Kimberly so today I'm gonna be cooking um put chicken in the oven so I just wanted to show you guys um some cooking skills that I know how to make <laughs> so here are the ingredients so the type of chicken I'm gonna be using is the gold leaf is this type it's the chicken leg quarters um it's 10 pounds so this is what I'm gonna be using um today in the oven um, so let me get everything out the ingredients that I'm going to be using. Okay, so first things first, we have to preheat the oven to 350. So I'm going to do that right now. Here it is. I'm going to we're going to bake, and it's already set to 350. And we're just going to press start, and when that hits 350, and it's, the oven is ready, so we can put the chicken in there. I have my chicken here with hot water because it's still kind of frozen. But with hot water, um, it will unfreeze. So I just have to prepare the chicken. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I have my chicken here. And I'm just going to be using this Chef Merito Chicken Seasoning um, Bollo, which is Bollo's Chicken. So I'm just going to be do putting the sauce right here. And that's going to go in the oven. I already have the oven on, so it needs to preheat. So I'm just going to season the chicken. Okay, so we're going to be using this one. It's already used, so that's why it looks like that. Um, and we're going to go ahead and put some heavy-duty aluminum foil onto here. And here what the chicken looks like, all seasoned. So let's do that. Okay, guys, so this is what it looks like. I, it only fit three because they're big. So I'm going to go ahead and use this little small one to put the other ones in there. So here's two more. I'm not going to be using, um, I'm not going to be using the whole chicken. I'm normally going to be using like five pieces of chicken. Uh, these ones, I'm just going to zip them up um, in the Ziploc and put them in the freezer. Um, I think, uh, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, yeah, five piece of chicken is more than enough so uh, when the oven is gonna be ready I'll show you guys so I'll be I'll be back okay so now I'm just gonna cut some potatoes and we use the Pacific gold um, roussette potatoes oh my god I love potatoes I'm just gonna cut them in um, circles and um, it's gonna go in the oven as well so we're gonna use this is one Two, three, four, five. So the oven is 350. It just um, it made a noise right now, so it means that it's ready. And we're going. I'm gonna go ahead and pop the big one in. Well, that's gonna go in there. In there, just like that. And then. The other one right here, right next to it, like that. So there you go. I'm gonna close it, and we're gonna let it bake. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the potatoes. Okay, so I'm going to put them in these little baking pots. I'm going to put foil paper in there. Salt and black pepper. You guys can see that. Oh. 
All right, guys, so this is what it looks like. So I'm going to pop it in the oven. All right, so everything is nice and ready. The chicken's in the oven, the potatoes in the oven. And um, now I'm just going to wash up and clean all my mess that I made. Okay, guys, so I'm going to make a uh, red, red rice. So I'm going to use one cup of red rice. So this is the rice that I use. I'm going to use one cup. Like, like this, just like that. And to make it red, I like to use the nor. Uh, it says tomato in there, and it's red. So that's what it looks like. It's red. And I have a pan here. I have a pan here. It just needs to get hot. It's a little hot now and I was just gonna add some vegetable oil or any vegetable that you have like that and we're gonna mix it like that and we're just gonna wait until it's nice and hot and then we're gonna go ahead and add the rice in there okay guys so now it's, it's nice and hot and we're just gonna add the rice And we're just going to mix it until it's nice and golden brown. Okay guys, so a few minutes later, um, this is what the rice looks like. It's nice and brown. So I want to go ahead and add one cup of water. I'm going to add more water. Like two. And there's three. I'm only going to add three cups of water. Like that. You can add more if you want. And now we're going to add our sauce. going to add a little bit. I don't want to add it too much. Like that. And we're going to stir it together. Just like that. And it's going to turn red by itself, which is amazing. So you don't have to add any, uh, any tomato because this already has color in there. Which is amazing. Add a little bit more. Okay, so we're just going to let this boil, and when it boils, we're going to cover it, and we're going to put the timer for 20 minutes, and um, it's going to let it cook. So, yeah. It's getting nice and browned, and the potatoes are there, right there. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I'm going to take the potatoes out and turn them around so they won't burn. <laughs> but, um, this is what the potatoes look like. I'm just gonna turn them around. So, so I'm just gonna turn them around and um, I'm gonna pop it back in the oven so they can cook the other way. And this is what the rice is looking like. So we're just gonna give it a little stir. And we're gonna put 20 minutes on my phone and that should be ready in 20. So let me flip this. All right, guys, so look at this beautifulness of chicken. I'm going to be taking it out and put it in, in a plate. It's nice and crunchy. It's delicious. Look at this beautifulness of chicken. I'm going to take the other one out, put it right here. And it is all good to go. Potatoes are ready. The rice is ready and the chicken is ready.
yep it's dinner time that was the whole cooking that i did today the chicken the rice potatoes everything everything looks delicious i really hope you guys enjoy this video if you did give it a big thumbs up subscribe and um push that notification bell as well and um have a nice day stay safe stay home and i will see you guys next time bye